Loco, please say Womp Womp in a cute voice. No. Womp Womp! Okay, so, no, stop it. Loco, now do it in a really low, burly voice. What do you mean, bro? My default voice is very... Like, my normal... <laughs> what is this? I can't believe this. Loco's normal voice is already squeaky. Yeah. Why are you guys making fun of my chipmunk voice? Why does it even sound like in stream? Hold up, let me listen. No, stop. That looks cursed as hell, man. I don't know. Ah! Uh, this is a VTuber avatar that you made for me? Cursed. Cursed! I mostly got the audio interface so I could, like, do a bunch of devices all in one, man. Make sure it's got really clean preamps and everything, so everything should look really nice. The roaring heart does much All we really want body. is just the funny effects. Even more, perhaps, for the restless soul. I can't believe it. Very toxic. Can the audio interface give you a beard? No. Am I going to do No Shave November? I've already failed. Look, with the insane amount of facial air I have, it's just unmanageable, dude. It's just ridiculous. I think I can do another effect. Resignation. So. This is a, a bitch shift. So I can make my voice slightly different. If I want to. Got a point, please. Okay. Test, test. Oh God. I haven't. I haven't tested these yet. Hello. Fun gimmicks, I suppose, guys, but kind of pointless. I can become Brian, though, so that's nice, I guess. I'm glad everything is working out well so far, though, guys. I was a little concerned we're going to run into audio Lone issues. I but... haven't been here in a while. Can someone give me a TLDR of the last three months? And happy belated birthday, Lovey. What's going on, Lurch? Thank you very much for the 28 months. TLDR for the last three months of streaming? Um, basically, I completed about five dozen games, everything on the first try, it didn't even fail a single time. Twitch shows like, oh my god, my streamer, my streamer, I can't believe he was this good at the, and, you know, just... Basically Resigned like it was every month before that too, but good to see you back, man. Waited for death. Yeah, that's, that's exactly what happened. Man, I was giggling yesterday. Can I show you guys real quick? I was going over the comments on the More Loco YouTube channel. And this one guy was leaving a negative reaction on quite literally every single one of my Half-Life 2 playthrough episodes, which is pretty hilarious. Oh yeah, here we go. This guy right over here. There's leaving negative comment after negative comment about how I'm playing the game and that I'm playing things wrong. Loco cheats within the first video because he's not paying attention. And there's like... There's like dozens of them, of this one person, but still on like episode like 18 or whatever. He's still going pretty hard. It's kind of funny to me that some people are leaving negative comments and telling me that I'm playing terrible, but yet they're Supplies watching 18 hours way. worth of content. If you can make it. <laughs> that doesn't make sense in my head, but maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. It's like, I f***ing hate this so much, I'm gonna watch another hour. <laughs> And I'm gonna comment again on the mistakes he's made. <laughs> I love the passion Call for the game, but waste. it's kind of funny. There's a certain irony there, that's for sure. It sounds like a toxic relationship, it really does. It's been on memory. Memory, I now am one step closer to being a VTuber. I hope you're excited for me. You as a VTubing connoisseur. He has a voice changer, but no avatar. Are you suggesting VTubers use voice changers, Pete Riarchi? That's not true. That's exactly what she sounds like in real life. You just don't get it. Gosh. Can't believe this toxicity, man. Is that the same guy who was angry about the cat cam? Yeah, that was pretty funny, though. Someone was leaving angry comments on my second channel on multiple videos that he hated the cat cam in the stream. <laughs> <laughs> That's dangerous, man. Complaining about someone's pets in general? A dangerous move on the internet especially. But then cats. Cats in particular. Yeah, this person was like, Loco, I love the video, 
But the cat cam is really distracting. Please get rid of it. <laughs> it's okay. It's fine. They actually didn't mean it in a, in, a, in, a, in a bad way, I don't think. I think they were just trying to, you know, be nice about it. But complaining about pets on the internet is like the exact opposite of what most people want. People are like, no, more pets. Show all the pets on screen all of the time. Oh, here you go. I haven't seen these comments. You should make the full screen, the cat cam, and have the StarCraft content be in the current cat cam's position. Much better. I would actually prefer if the cat cam covered the map. We don't really need to see the map, but the location is often has obstructions, big chunk of the actual playfield. Really? Dude, I hate it whenever streamers cover up the minimap in StarCraft 2. As a matter of fact, I don't think I watch anyone who covers the minimap with anything in StarCraft 2. It's uh, hmm, interesting. No, I disagree, man. I, I don't think you can block the, the minimap. Blocking the minimap is not, man. It's not, not allowed. Anyways, I only have the cat cam on screen whenever the, the cats are actually here. But turns out, right, cats don't actually care about my opinion. My cats just, they just kind of, like, they, they accept me as being around and stuff. I'm allowed to, like, clean their litter box, which is pretty sweet, dude. I'm very glad I have that honor. They stomach my existence, but I can request if they want to go upstairs, but they don't really necessarily go with what I'm suggesting. Bro, I thought this was my microphone f***ing up. It's hailing like crazy. Yeah, it's coming from the roof and from the windows. There's a... Okay, I haven't seen any hail in forever. Can you hear it? All right, try restarting Windows, Loco. I'll try restarting IRL. You are at max volume on your speakers. Loco, I hope your car is protected. It most definitely is not. It's like right there. Is this a problem? I don't know, guys. It's already switched over to rain. No, the Netherlands doesn't get the craziest, uh, the craziest hill. I've seen pictures of like other countries where you get like, you know, snowball sized amounts of, of it's already done what the hell it stopped raining how the f did that work that was like a good 30 seconds okay maybe a minute or two okay see i don't trust irl man irl is just not not it's probably fake like i think this is proof that we live oh my god what yeah no see this is what what the f is oh my god okay fine i had to accept a bunch of stuff yeah no i have um I have never seen something like this in real life. That seems lethal, dude, if you get one of those in your head. It literally destroyed her, her car window? Amazing. I mean, amazing that it's possible. Yeah, those fingernails were also grossing me out a little bit, but I think it's probably just the bottom part of what- Wait, she's not wearing- She's barefoot. There's- a, that's a foot right over there. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, here's the theory, okay? This is probably- I think this is a guy, right? Because only guys are stupid enough to walk outside in the rain barefoot, right? Not a lot of women will be that dumb. Pretty sure this is like a lady that like grabbed a bunch of handful and then her boyfriend was like with his foot in the frame taking a picture of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You think he's naked? Could be, bro. Loco can confirm I'm that dumb. Same. And then I would complain as well afterwards that my feet are cold and dirty. Yeah. Hobbit shaming. The water was 20 plus centimeters, so whether you wear shoes or not, you'd get wet. Oh, well, that's not good. That sounds kind of rough, actually. Anyways, usually the weather over here, not that crazy. Wait, that's a... Dude, that's actually kind of wild, though. I've heard of these types of... Jeez. Good picture. This one's my favorite. Look at that story about paint wall. Yeah, dude. So apparently, guys... I've mentioned this in the past, the most dangerous animal before, you know, this year, in the Netherlands at the very least, was probably like a f like that big of a snake, right? Maybe, maybe a squirrel or something. Maybe a swan. A swan could definitely hurt you if it tried. But over the last couple of years, it's gotten quite bad with the amount of um, wolves that we have in the Netherlands. Apparently wolves have come in from Germany. Always the German. No. <laughs> no, they've fairly come from Germany. 
And, uh, yeah, they're having a grand old time to the point right now where they quite literally walk up to humans and try to steal their lunch. And apparently they have grown a little bit too tame, which is bad, as long as they're not hungry. You know, if they're, if they're hungry, things probably can go south really quick. But they have been killing, like, wildlife and, and all kinds of stuff. Germans taking Dutch people's lunches. Ah, uh, you missed the key word in that sentence, and that was wolves. Wolves from Hungary would be even worse, yeah. They would be very aggressive because they're hungry. Awoo! Awoo! Loco, what was that? Nothing. I got a new audio interface and I'm basically a 12 year old now. Like, mentally I already was, but now I've got the tools for it right here. Just to. Uh. It's very disturbing in my headphones because I hear myself in real time like that, and it's really weird. That's actually my true voice. Yeah. It is ours. I can go the other way too. This is way better. I think I have to talk slowly with this one because otherwise it's really hard to follow. This is going to be fun for about three streams and then I'm sick and tired of it. Until then, you'll have to uh, endure, I guess. Can I do a voice change on Brian? Brian is perfect just the way he is. Why would you even suggest such a thing? I can also just add an echo, okay? So, this is uh, when I'm standing in my living room, in my cathedral at home. Dorime, Dorime, Ameno, Ameno, Very useful. Very useful. Nobody will tell me otherwise. Gregorian chants. That's what we need, dude. Oh. <laughs> My dad used to listen to Gregorian singing when I was a kid. Sometimes we would like ride in the car and like the only thing that he had was like this Gregorian monk thing. I never quite understood it. I absolutely hated it as a kid. I thought it was so weird. Like, it was like the most embarrassing thing I could come up with. Like, imagine one of my classmates seeing my, like, me and my dad in a car while my dad is listening to Gregorian monk songs. There you go. Well done. Can you do a cheeky little heal on him? Or should I try and finish it? I should probably try and finish it. A slow Burn, mother. Okay, well done. Unavoidable end. That's not lucky. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Well then, huh? In theory, at least the setup is good, I promise you. The final chord is struck. What the f That is so unlucky, man. These f***ers have been on death's door for like three turns and this guy gets on death's door after getting unlucky once and he dies right away. I don't see another way out. You know what? Argyle is a fellow streamer now, okay? He understands what it means to do something for the content. This must be why he did it. Well done. This has to be the reason. He knows, he understands that for the content, it is much better for me to fail than it is to succeed. For every miscalculation, a consequence. Surely. Surely that is what happened. So you know the sad part? This entire party already has all abilities unlocked. So even though I'm right next to a hero shrine, I actually get no value out of it. Like literally nothing. That's so sad, man. You should just ban the whole team when you die, Loco, because it's a team game. If I banned every single one of the people that has been part of one of my parties so far, I would have like three viewers remaining, JW. Great idea, though. It's not that I don't like your idea, but is that a bad thing, Loco? I'm pretty sure you'd be banned twice, Zekert. At least. Let's go down, Thort. Thort, Argyle has been bullying me, even though he hasn't really been, you know, in the chat. I mean, he's been in the chat, but he hasn't really said that much. But he's still bullying me, and I'm upset. No one else seems to be upset, though. Just me. <sighs> Passive bullying. Yeah. Thort is here now. Everything will be better. Did anyone say Romania? I don't remember. I need. I knew one sentence in Romanian, but I forgot. Salut, Safa. That could be. That could be French, though. 
Say fussy. I learned a couple weeks ago, guys, that apparently in Romania it used to be common. Not the case anymore. To have some strong liquor for breakfast. <laughs> I don't remember the name of it. But apparently a lot of people back in the day would start their day with a shot of <laughs> whatever it was called. Tuisa? Tu I don't know how you pronounce it. My favorite part about this drink. Um, where is it? Yes. It's a Romanian spirit that contains between 24 and 86% alcohol. <laughs> it's quite the range. It, you know, it's, it's maybe a little, but could also be a lot. <laughs> <laughs> you might accidentally have, you know, a little, little, uh, you know, maybe a bit of an exciting start of your day. It's more fun if you have multiple bottles with different kinds of percentages and you just, you know, you close your eyes and you start with one. But apparently it's not commonly, uh, you know, a breakfast drink anymore these days. This is on your desk right now, Thort. You finished two of them. Those are two empty bottles. No, that's water, man. That's, I'm pretty sure that's water. That was yesterday. Five liters of water. That's a big bottle, man. You know what? If that's a five liter bottle. Yeah, that's a two liter bottle of liquor. <laughs> I was going to say five liters is a lot of water. Not bad. I don't even know if you can buy two liter bottles of liquor over here. Two liters of liquor is a weekend. Oh, my God. You make your own. That's awesome. <laughs> what is this? Am I gonna... <laughs> Horse cart and drunk man accident in Romania. Can I watch this? <laughs> What's... What's he doing? <laughs> oh, wait. wait, what? How did that... I... What's he doing? I have no idea what happened in that video, man. Just another day in Romania. Nobody uses a horse anymore over here, man. The only people having horses in, in the Netherlands are people that have a lot of money. That seems to be the, the horse build order. They're not, they're not used as, you know, not used for work. Do I have a horse? No, I definitely don't have a horse. On your ranch, Loco? No, 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 no. People don't own ranches in the Netherlands, okay? He's Only very wealthy though. people do. Or, you know, people in the south. But that's basically Belgium. Ugh. 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 No. No, no, no. How about a yacht? No, 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 no. Get a pony, Loco. You can park it in the garage. <laughs> I don't have a garage. But also, if I did, I would... <laughs> Still a really bad idea. Apparently, most horses have more than one horsepower, Sumo. Today's oversight is tomorrow. This is some sick bait that the car industry has made us believe, apparently. I don't know if it's a car industry, but apparently many horses have, like, three horsepower. Maybe it's because horses back in the day weren't as big as they are right now or something? I don't really know how it works, but... Eliminator mentioned a couple days ago that his brother got a cat. But he didn't pay the cat tax. Whenever you have to, uh, you know, share the news of a new animal... For obvious reasons, the cat tax has uh, the cat tax had to be paid. You can't just mention you got a new puppy without showing the puppy, right? Everybody understands this. Let's see. Oh my god, it's so small! It's very small! Bro, it's so tiny! How old is he? That is so small. Also, you gotta dust that your brother's gotta anyways. Slash R slash illegally small cats. <laughs> That's fantastic. And in your kitten after failed attempt to steal food. <laughs> Not OP, but felt like you guys needed to see a little shrimp. Oh my god. I'm gonna close out of Domekeeper. Thank you, Domekeeper.
I was told this might be long here. Oh, he's fast, dude. Look at the speed. <laughs> right next to a remote. Okay. I don't think we can listen to that. He made Thanksgiving dinner, but you never showed up. Why is he eating green beans? I don't know if they can eat green beans, dude. Oh. <laughs> it's a great subreddit. Went hunting, came back with Frank. You named that cat Frank? That's the, I don't I don't know about Frank, dude. That does not look like a Frank to me. Is Frank the cat or the human? I think the cat. That's how you get a cat? Oh my god. Is there also a slash r slash illegally small dogs? What are they doing? <laughs> These cats are high as hell, man. They're like two weeks old. <laughs> okay, no, I think I, I think they're uh they're they're a little older than that, but they're seeing a ghost. Amazing. Wait, what? This guy bought, brought a cat to... to oh, no. <laughs> cats are great. Highly recommend cats. A very small checkup. <laughs> what did they have to do to the little kitten, man? Oh, my God. There is slash r slash illegally small dogs. Excellent. All time. I'm ready. <laughs> Why is he wearing a shirt? Stop. Stop putting clothes on him, dude. That's so unnecessary. <laughs> dude, careful, dude. What are you doing, man? That was dangerous, dude. Who? Huh. Okay, no, no, I don't like this video that much. Just shy of two pounds. What's going on in the background here? Why are there little little tubs with saws? My new intern is useless. Small puppy winks at the camera. Beware of the attack dog. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to have a dog again someday. Dogs are pretty great. Half of my chat is engineers. Uh, not well, you know, you're not far off. I don't know exactly how many, but I mean, I don't have camera installed in every single one of my viewers' homes, you know. But uh, just a majority. And um... wait, no, no. Make a poll. <laughs> What's the poll? Are you an engineer? <laughs> yes. No. People, people don't lie on the internet, right? Say womp if you're an engineer. I don't think that would work. No. Yes, no, German. <laughs> are you saying Germans are just engineers by default? That's true. What if you're a German engineer? The cream of the crop, probably. They're born with calipers in hand. <laughs> they come out with a measuring tape and everything, dude. Love to see it. We cannot talk about my Ansprache guys for Zekering. <laughs> this is what you have to learn for your A1 levels? Unsprakelijkheidsverzekering? Bro, those are not even words that... Are, like, that's what I'm talking about. This is a Dutch word right over here. That is not even that weird. Unsprakelijkheidsverzekering. It's not even that weird, and it's going to be nearly impossible to figure out if you're not Dutch. I have to always go over the most beautiful Dutch sentence that everybody always appreciates that's unfamiliar with the language. Here's a classic. I've said this one on stream many times before, but there's probably many people that have not heard it. Honey, I have a ship in Scheveningen. This is a city in the Netherlands. This would be pronounced as follows. Schat, ik heb een schip in Scheveningen. Schat, ik heb een schip in Scheveningen. Schat, ik heb een schip in Scheveningen. Which apparently sounds really weird. Sounds perfectly fine to me, but that's C1 levels, Loco. Yeah, okay. Loco, what about pick my most beautiful site in Dutch? I have been there before, man. 
I, I, I don't think it's, I don't think I can say this again. I got baited by this before. Pick my most beautiful side in Dutch. I will, I will, I, I will translate it for you, okay? This is a perfectly fine, reasonable Dutch sentence. There's nothing wrong about it. I have never even considered to be, uh, I've never even considered this to be a weird sentence or whatever. It makes no sense. So I translated this on stream like a year ago. What about this sentence? This is definitely a Dutch sentence, yes. Toen koos, 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 koos terug. <laughs> it works, yes, that is a fine sentence. There's nothing wrong about that sentence. I don't even really need that, to be honest. It'd be nice. Get the chip loco. I don't know if I need the chip, guys. I think I'd rather have 24. Like the laser, the stun laser would be nice. But I'd have to drag it all the way back home because you can't throw that in a teleporter, can you? Hello, can someone get this Motlesses guy out of here with his toxic backseat gaming? Yeah, I can convert it to Cobalt. But I'm full HP right now. I think I'm gonna be late now. I'm too late, I'm too late. Yeah, I'm gonna blame Motlesses for, uh, yeah, just, uh, things, reasons, that sort of thing. I think n not bringing the trip or the, the chip home for now is fine. Mostly because it really seems to upset Motlesses, which makes leaving it right over there definitely worth it. Oh, he's getting all upset, guys. Why do you do this to us, Loco? Why would this happen to me? <laughs> I've made my mistakes. Guys in the chat right now. Just bring the goddamn chip home, Loco! <laughs> Loco the chip! Loco, I will ban someone every 60 seconds until you return the chip. Alright, Mont, give it a try. See how it goes. Maybe Ben Fear Dragon? What's up, Fear Dragon? How are you doing, dude? Um, I actually am gonna have to... If I want to get that, though, I'm gonna have to go back. Wait, was it 12 or 16 for the upgrade? Oh, no, it's 20 for the final one. Ah, never mind. Should probably use this before Bunny Warren loses his mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, dude. Watching me play video games, huh? This is probably the most stressful thing you'll have to do all day, guys. You have to do it, right? It takes 10 years off your life. <laughs> I can't wait for the YouTube comment section, man. It's gonna be a beautiful disaster. Remember that chip I found some time ago? I don't remember where it is. <laughs> I don't even know where it is. Never mind, I was, I was gonna bring it home. But uh, yeah, no longer. A beautiful disaster. What do you know my ex from, Loco? Are you flexing with how beautiful your ex is? Yo. As the person on YouTube said, it's still interesting to watch you play. It's just unbelievably frustrating. I, li I literally started today saying how many people can I upset today with my gameplay. Today today may be a new, a new standard. Like you're watching the development of a new standard today, guys. Correct answer? Everybody. I couldn't help but notice, by the way, that Fear Dragon on my stream is actually really nice. I've been lurking in some other people's channels. Like, even though Fear Dragon is trolling me on my stream all the time, he's like, this is like, this is low level RV, man. This is like Silver League level of RV right now. In other streams, he's like master, grandmaster level trolling. Minimum. Bad boy Fear Dragon? Oh, yeah. Bad boy is, uh, or it's an understatement. You have 99 plus bans and timeouts on Sal's channel. Hey, look, guys, another chip. What should I do with that one? Ban Motlesses? <laughs> Ignore it, Loco. I'm gonna bring it. Echo, today is one of those days where I am infuriating a few people in the chat. And you know what that means. If I'm infuriating guys in the chat, it must mean that I am absolutely upsetting guys in the YouTube comments. I'm looking forward to it. Take the chip, Loco. Okay, I took it a little bit to leave it there. Poor Motlesis just wants to help. 
Mott, I am trying to win the game. I'm not trying to collect all the resources. I don't need to chip. It takes me like a full run to bring that all the way upstairs for no apparent reason. <laughs> it's not useful. It's not a good idea. Uh, we're playing infinite mode, so I think it just keeps going. I don't really know exactly when it ends. Probably when Motless is, uh orders a DDoS attack on my computer. I think that's probably uh, when this run ends, dude. Chip, 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 chip. Sorry, what now? How deep does it go? Really? 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 Let's be real, that's not what she said, dude. Uh, you know what? I can't believe no one's brought this up, but I'm actually gonna... Remember those things I've harvested some time ago? I'm actually just gonna bring them to the surface. I'm a little offended no one has mentioned this before, but I think it'd be helpful if we brought them to the base. Don't you just hate it when your cat wakes you up like this? Meow. 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 Meow, 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 meow. Not really, no. But thank you, Ravros. Motlesis, man. That was beautiful, wasn't it? Motlesis is, uh, yeah. This is peak life. It's all downhill from here. It doesn't get any better, Mot. There is another chip somewhere else, but I'd hope that, you know, people had forgotten about that one. I will pay $10 if you bring chips next to your dome, but don't actually turn them in. <laughs> Just leave them! Oh my god, that's a great idea. I love everything about that plan. We'll just leave them right outside of the face. I would do that for free. I, I just didn't consider that yet. I'll have to go hunting for that thing on the right side of the map somewhere, man. Bribe paid. <laughs> Hold up, hold up. <laughs> Fear Dragon is a monster, confirmed. Thank you, uh, Ravi, for the $13. Hey! Alright, I think it's time for the bribe. Yo! Hi, YouTube. Hey! <laughs> Look what I found! Uh, I'm actually gonna be late. I. <laughs> Drop him off, drop him off, drop Go! Bro, I need to go home! Chip, chip, chip. Mom's gonna be chip, so chip, angry chip, when she chip, finds chip, out I'm not home at the time, chip. dude! How is the most successful run I've had in this game so far? Also the most upsetting. How did that happen? Okay, I'm gonna pick up the chips. I think I know where they are. They were over here and then straight down. Somewhere. There they are. to turn in the chips. <laughs> wait, 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 hold up now. What do I do? A double bribe. I'm playing two sides of the story now, man. No turn in. All right. This is the easiest money I've ever made, dude. Just play the game. Oh, I could turn in one. I'm sure that will not upset anybody, right? I've seen enough criminal movie type of things that um, this will definitely work out. Excellent idea. Good job, Loco. Oh, I will get a useless thing that I won't get any help out of. Nice. Got an elevator, baby. That's really good. Now I can uh, make no use of that. Sold to Fear Dragon for 2,600 million bits. Loco turned into a real monstrous streamer. Yeah, yeah. I'm a douchebag right now, man. This is my, uh... You know how, like, artists and music artists and all that have, like, different faces in their career? This is clearly my bad boy face, you know? No more Mr. Nice Guy. This is my Kanye West yes, face? Sure. Are you saying Kanye West is not a nice guy? Wait. What gave that away? 
Oh, dude. Oh, shit, man. I don't even have to do anything anymore. So upsetting people pays really well. I've been doing it wrong for years, man. I've been streaming for like close to a decade at this point, it seems, but... Plus dinner on Tuesday at Atlanta when we get to Stockholm. <laughs> there you go, GG. Wait, that's next week's Tuesday though, right? Not this week, right? <laughs> I got a date with Fear Dragon, dude, by upsetting Mutlasses. This is well worth it. Dreams do become true, guys. Loco, thanks for all the advice on how to sell out. Right? Any good memes on the StarCraft subreddit? Super soldiers? Are Reapers here? <laughs> Is this real? It looked fake. That's super fake, mate. That's real? No. Really? Why does it look so fake? I feel like if it was fake, they'd probably speed up him, you know, putting the straps around his crotum. I mean, thighs. Yep, yep. Make sure you tuck him under the balls. Very important. Then you can fly perfectly. Otherwise, you steer to the left. Don't want to do that. Oh, it's the thing on his back where the boost is coming from. I thought for a second it was only the f***ing hands. That made no sense. It's the thing on his back that's doing the, the actual... Otherwise, you, yeah, it has to be both, obviously. But I thought for some reason that it was only the things in his hands that were doing the the boost. That <laughs> You would fly that way. <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome, man. What the hell? That's cool, though. So Reapers aren't really that far off, huh? It's from this? Gra Gravity Industries? No, this is in Florida. Oh my god, what the hell? They maneuver exactly like Reapers do! Florida man has leveled up, dude! What the f***? This is as high as they go, I guess, but... Yo, that's amazing. I have never seen it as... Uh, so, highlights from a great couple days of flying? That's awesome, dude. How, how risky is this, though? What if he accidentally puts his, like, foot underneath that blast? Does it, like, burn off his arm or his foot? Like, how does this... <laughs> I feel like it's dangerous. <laughs> it has to... It has to come at a whole lot of risk, right? Am I crazy? It's got about two hours of flight time. I feel like I've seen this video before. It starts at 380,000 pounds. Yeah, but the military doesn't give a f dude. American military, those guys have cash. That's pocket change. Half a million dollars for one set? They don't care. This should be a, uh, a selling point for joining the special forces somehow. I feel like a lot of nerds would sign up. <laughs> That's awesome. I really like that. There's two ways to look at Europe. There is Central and Europe in Eastern Europe. Which would make the Netherlands Western Europe. Wait, what? The Netherlands is considered Western Europe on both of these maps? I guess? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. It is a little funky though. It's definitely political for sure. It's pretty far to the west, but in my mind, it's pretty centered, you know what I mean? In my mind, right? Yeah. The Netherlands was the center of the world. So anything from here is eastern, southern, northern, or western. Therefore, I am a little confused. Yeah, the Netherlands is the main protagonist of IRL, isn't it? Like the sun really... <laughs> Literally revolves around the net. Right, you saying that's not the case? Huh? Imagine being American loco and hearing about the Western world, but they are east of me? Well, we're also west of you, Sis Hetman. Suffering. My favorite thing is seeing maps from other parts of the world where the US isn't in the center of the map. 
I actually thought this was a joke years ago, sysadmin, because someone brought this up. But apparently in the States, they use a map where the US is centered. On, I guess it kind of makes sense. I'd never seen one, though. Wait, is that actually what the map looks like? Wait, a world map in the... Hold up. If you're talking about a world map, I'm a little confused about how I'm supposed to view it. Like, this is... this is Okay, so this is what I'm talking about. This is the type of world map I have ever... That, that I have ever seen, always. Like, whenever there's, like, a flat map of the world, it's always like this. Where, like, Europe is in the center, I guess, at, like, the zero degree mark, and then everything is from there east and west. This is, this is what most people have, right? Am I wrong? But from what I understand, in the US, people use a different map when they discuss the world map that has the states in the center, like this. And I had never seen this before. This looks weird to me. I know it doesn't matter because it's a flat map and it's a globe and everything. This looks weird, right? Like it's half of Asia is over there and the other half is over there. <laughs> it doesn't matter, Loco. This looks normal. <laughs> I've never used that, Loco. <laughs> this looks really cursed. Loco, I'm American. I've never seen this before. So wait, there's some Americans in the chat that are like, yeah, this is what I know. Interesting. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> no, bro. This, this I cannot work with. Whatever the going on on this stream. <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm good. Honestly, this one is even more confusing, but which map do flat earthers use? Which what was the hold up? Flat earther world map. I'm curious now. Loco different states of different education budgets. Right. <laughs> Wait, budgets. Oh, I sorry. I thought you said okay, that's not what I thought you were going to say. Oh, this is a flat earther map? Bro, that's cursed as hell. That is, there's not, that's, no. Oh, I found a good one. New standard of the map. Scientifically and practically correct. What are we looking at? This is 1892 though. This is, wait, is this? This is not practical at all, dude. I don't know what I'm looking at. I, I don't know what the practical use of this would be. The Peters projection? Ah, the Peters projection is ein von Arno Peters. 1974. Okay, I think it's about the map. Oh my god, that's cursed as hell. Is this the actual accurate map? I wouldn't be surprised if this is more in scale because I know Africa is considered to be absolutely massive. By size, this is accurate. I mean, it's going to be very difficult to get a globe on a flat map, but... Yeah, the truesize.com is like the, the most interesting thing. I don't know if you guys are familiar with this website. I've, I've spent too much time on this website in the past, but it's actually pretty cool. So this is a website where you can drag around different areas. So this is the entirety of the US without Alaska and stuff. Uh, but you can actually drag the size of it on like, for example, on top of Europe. Just kind of cool. Since, you know, usually we use a, uh, a flat map, things get a little bit funky, so... Roughly speaking, it's about the same size of Australia. It's like Texas. Texas laid on top of... This is what kind of boggles my mind. So this is the state of Texas. Texas is massive. From what I understand, it's empty for the majority of it, but... Actually huge. I live there, Loco. It can confirm. What about, uh, Australia? Yeah, so Sweden and Norway are kind of cursed, you know? Because, like, you always see them like this. Oh my god, I've never actually seen a map of Sweden like that before. For some reason, that does not... Anyways. If we drag this over a little further south, it's not nearly as... Anyways. It's a dong? That's a... Mate, if this is what your dong looks like, you gotta go see a doctor, man. That's not correct. That's... You got- that's not right, man. Your dong is the size of Sweden? Damn, bro. Okay, let's see. Can I get two different upgrades in one re- uh, I- yeah, I got one of them. A gorgeous moon. Generates extra gems and gathers all of them? Yo, that's actually sick. So now it's the exact opposite of what it did earlier? 
Pretty good. Damn! I don't know what exactly just happened, but I like it. I'm a fan. Wait, it call it becomes a vacuum orb? So the vacuum orb thing, I just... Pointless? Absolutely pointless? Oh, I see, I see, I see. Well, why didn't you tip? No, I'm just kidding. It's okay. That's why we said don't, don't, you know what, guys? You can only protect those streamers for that much, right? At some point, they gotta go out there into the world and make their own mistakes. Like, you try your best to protect them, but... They just want to go out there and make some mistakes of their own. There's only so much you can do. There it is. Union of the Vura there to fellow and the... Why does it go away so quick? <laughs> what the f Okay, this character's pretty good. I've now got lasers. Like, I'm now essentially a Void Ray. And we all know those are really fucking good. How do you guys feel about Santa Water for my final weapon? So I'll try that another run. Oh my god, bro. I don't even have to play the game anymore. I am maxed out on, on everything. I've got splash damage. I'm like I'm like Sky Tools with High Templar. And a mothership. And then the mothership has cloaking from another mothership above it. I don't even have to do anything. This is what it feels like to be an anime protagonist. Well, yeah, or or a Skytos player. Essentially the same thing. Don't get too greedy, Loco. I don't even think I can lose. Maybe I can. I don't know. I'm gonna find out. I don't think I'm gonna die until I get to the final boss. It's not bad, huh? Got some more uh, upgraded Santa water too. Because I wasn't powerful enough. <laughs> so this is a feeling you won't get in God of War. Isn't it fantastic how you can make a sick game by yourself? And then sell it on the internet without having to really be attached to any publishing company or anything like that. And it being a good game is really the only marketing that you need. Like, obviously, for every successful game, right? Like this one, there's like a hundred thousand that aren't. But it's a good time to be a game developer, it seems. Yeah, yeah, but there's like, there's like so many people interested in indie games, too. And I really am impressed that they decided to sell this game for, I think it's literally four bucks. Literally four bucks. It's free on the uh, the Game Pass. I didn't buy. Uh, I didn't buy it. I, I got it in the Game Pass because you know, four bucks is four bucks. <laughs> no, but seriously, like it's cool that you can you know make something like this. Yeah. Some enemies are actually getting to me. Maybe I'm moving too fast. This is now move left, move right simulator instead. I'm just kidding. I'm gonna go back right. I guess I can just stand still. Yeah, true. Oh yeah, actually, you're right. My character gets 1% additional might per level up. That is a character feature. Yeah, this is the table, right? Is this the is this the table I can get the boss baited behind? I think so. So this is where I'm gonna hang out at the 30 minute mark, but I guess until that point, I just have to walk down. Until that point, I'm just gonna sit right over here. What does this look like on Twitch? Hold up, I'm gonna go to Twitch. That the, I'm gonna go watch my own stream here for a sec. I wanna see what it looks like. I mean, it looks pretty bad on Source. But it's, it's not terrible. This is the Cell Sword Void Race. Yeah. Cell Sword Twin Voids. Yeah, it's just a compression, guys. There's nothing I can do about Twitch compression. Oh, look. Brenda is here. Oh, can Brenda go in? Wow, Brenda.
Brenda! Brenda has a lot of health. Why be a king when you can't be a god? <laughs> Level 99. Suck it up! Level 100, baby! Okay, we should have a good couple of achievements now. Yeah, we should have a good couple achievements now. Yeah, yeah, it's triggering very soon. <laughs> Level 143. Okay, I... Ooh. There's not much I can do. Five seconds. Okay, I'm gonna start inching down. Nice. <laughs> this game is so f dumb. It makes no sense. What do you even want me to do? It, it, uh. Oh, okay, okay. Turns out I respawn. Wait, what? Okay, I got another refive, don't I? Okay, it did not work. But... We did get him stuck behind. There's a table here somewhere. You can't. Oh, yeah, there it is. I'm not gonna move. I'm not gonna move. There's a second Reaper appearing in 30 seconds. Can I kill this one at least? I don't know if you can kill it. I think so. It seems to be taking damage. But the pentagram did not kill it, so I don't know. Okay, there's another one spawning here in five seconds. Uh, maybe I get lucky and they both get stuck. What? Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Control it on the floor. Control it on the floor. Don't step on it. Okay, you're right. I'm gonna put it back on the desk. <sighs> okay. I'm assuming there's gonna be another one that will spawn here in 15 seconds? Am I winning? I don't know. I feel like I am. Dead. What? No, I got another one stuck. Dude. This is the most satisfying stuck related video you will ever see in your life. Didn't even need a washing machine. Dude, they're not dying. They're not, like, they're just sitting there. Next one probably coming in from the bottom. I can't move, though. There's no way I can I can move. They have one million health. I must have done about a million damage to the guy up top, man. No, 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 no. No, 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 don't spoil. No spoilers. Okay, the fourth one did slide around. I can, re <laughs> I can revive again, but what's the point? I don't think I should revive again. There's absolutely no point. I'm gonna do it. Just so I can die again. Nice. Oh, by the way, I haven't told you guys yet. I tanked something with my forehead again. It's fine. Don't know red dot this time around, but this morning I was like half asleep. And for some reason I was like moving my arms around. And... Like, right above, like, the headboard of my bed, I had my Kindle, and somehow I hit it, and it, like, fell smack down straight on my forehead again. I was, I was asleep. It was really impressive. I was like, what the f*** is this? Anyways, um, yeah, my, my forehead has been, uh, it wasn't a door this time. No. No, 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 it wasn't a door above my bed. No, 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 no. My head, dude, I am losing brain cells left, right, and center. How old is Kratos? He's he's pretty old, right? 
He's a bit of a boomer. Like, is he older or, or younger than Motless is? Probably... Probably younger. <clears throat> Alright. That's the loading screen right there. Alright, chat. Are you ready? If you don't have at least four chins when you make that move, you didn't go far enough. You didn't lean far enough back. Nice chin, Loco. Thanks, guys. So wait, does he have his own inventory? What? <laughs> Not so easy, huh? <laughs> Shut up, bro. What did you just do? No, don't use your bow. Are you? How did you think that was gonna work? That's not how you open a chest, guys. I don't recommend opening chests like that. Oh. Dude, I really like what they've done with the world design in this game, though. Like, like the colors and stuff, everything is really sick. Like, it doesn't get boring, you know? Like, a lot of games, maybe it's my zoomer attention span or something, I don't know. But, like, a lot of games become boring uh -huh. and grindy Here's after a little Let's bit. Let's grab it. Who's it for? Wolves gotta eat, don't they? What the hell is that? I don't believe you. Oh, it's Gouda. <laughs> okay, I'm trying Gouda. really hard. But this is not an easy one to draw. Oh, what? salmon? Oh, my God. <laughs> why are they brown? <laughs> what do you mean, why are they brown? <laughs> are you what color brown? are the races you eat? Yeah. Purple. Purple? 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 No, the no. raisins are brown. Raisins are brown. No, they're not. Raisins yes, are they are. Oh, my God. They yes, are they are. We, I live in America where we they artificially are flavor and artificial Wait, raisins? raisins? Raisins, throw them raisins are, are absolutely purple in America. No, they're they, absolutely yes, they're they're brown. Brown. I don't know what you have, John. They are not brown. You do not eat brown raisins. That's disgusting. Wait, I mean, this... I, I, I googled them. American raisins. This is what I see. Is this what you would buy if okay. you buy raisins? Yes, that looks... Yeah. I yeah, mean, that looks raisins. moldy. That looks it's bad. artificially colored because we live in... Oh, oh wow. So the standard it. raisins we buy over here are the ones on the left. Yeah. Oh, Same here. Too. Oh, wow. There's yellow ones too. What the hell? Yeah. yeah, well, those are from, yeah, those white are grapes. Grapes. Those are from I yellow not grapes. Eat, I would yeah. not eat them. <laughs> oh my god, I never <laughs> considered this. <laughs> yeah, no, we, we get these. As a kid, I got tons of these things. Well, this is nice, yeah. I have those at home at the moment. Is she doing anything? Guys, my character does not attack. Wait. It's the cat! Bro. Oh, I've got, I've got two cats. <laughs> this hero is... <laughs> alright, 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 that's better, that's better, that's better. Um, I think I'll go garlic. Garlic will probably be pretty good at this early level. Okay, it's the red heart that I need, but... That's a lot of cats, guys. What the f*** is happening? Do I, is that good or bad? Okay, things died. Get him, cats. There you go, there you go. Okay, here come more bats. Yeah, yeah. So we need to get high level garlic. Garlic is OP, man. Both in real life as well as the game. How do you make food taste good? Garlic. Meow. Dude, if I show this, this character to my girlfriend, she's gonna get addicted to this game too. I feel like it's dangerous. She likes any game that has cats in it. I haven't yet gotten her to play Stray, but I feel like if she would, she would like call it best indie game of all time. Just like those game reviewers that I strongly disagree with. Loco, lock the door. Are you talking about real life or in game? Because I'm gonna say no to both. That's a check I can't cash. Locking my, my like not locking my door. I always lock my door, dude. No, no, I mean like the, the you know, 
the front door to your home. Apparently there's many places where people like just simply do not have to lock them. Just the thought of that gives me anxiety if I'm being honest with you. <laughs> just go into bed, your door's open. You kidding me, dude? You know take candle. You know take candle. A little too high, huh? <laughs> That's not right, dude. That's too cursed. I can't do that. That's nightmare material. I don't know if I'm ready for this. Is this now an ASMR stream? Yep. I'm changing into a cute bikini when we reach the sub goal, too. Not. Oh, roast it. Got him. Loco, I don't think anyone wants to see you in a bikini. I mean, I'd hope, so, but like, I, I'm not, you know what? Actually, <laughs> this is a bit disturbing, guys. I, I think I'm fine, man, but uh, I'll take it as a compliment. You know what?